Digging deeper into the case of a Fairfield police officer who shot and killed a 23 year old man in Fairfield. Tonight, what may have been some of Caleb Surface's final words. Not on your side's Jay Warren went looking for answers in the case. Fairfield police is not commenting about this investigation. In fact, they've turned it over to Ohio's Bureau of Criminal Investigation. In the meantime, we spoke to a neighbor who showed us the footprints where he says Caleb Surface was running from police. The farthest ones are him running with apparently the police officer behind him. James Bonhaus says 23-year-old Caleb Surface ran through his backyard as he tried to get away from police. The chase ended, he says, right in front of his house on St. Andrew's Court. Apparently, the police officer was standing right here because this is where the man with the metal locator was. And it looked like he picked, it appeared that he picked up two shells that were from the gun right here. As yet, what led to the deadly altercation hasn't been released. Police say Surface broke into his father's home here on Spyglass Hill Court and that his father Jeff called 911. When police arrived, Caleb ran out the back door. Earlier Saturday, Surface posted some troubling things to his Facebook page that included, quote, last words. And even more troubling, quote, beer and gun. Hmm, what to do? We tried to speak to Jeff Surface, Caleb's father, but there was a note on the door asking for privacy. In the meantime, the whole case is weighing heavily on neighbors, including Bonhaus. I cried all day yesterday. It was, it was a sad thing. It's a very sad thing. You had to have a young... Think if you had your son uh, or your son shot under any circumstances. The one piece of information Fairfield Police released to me today is the 911 call made by Jeff Surface, Caleb Surface's father, will be released tomorrow. We hope that sheds a lot more light on what happened leading up to this deadly altercation. Jay Warren, 9 on your side, Fairfield.